Hey guys and welcome back to another one and today I'm going to share with you a solution to a problem that I had here on the office and that solution is the power bar and the power cube. Now before we take a closer look at them, let me share with you a little bit of background so that you know what I'm talking about and this has all to do with cable management. Now as you can see on screen, all my cable management is behind my desk and also beneath my desk or underneath my desk to be more precise. Now I do have a cable management box as you can see there and my cable management just by the way it's not 100% perfect but is okay for me and especially because I do not believe that there is anything 100% perfect but that's just my opinion let's move on now as you can see uh, I've got that cable management box which I'll try not to forget to post a link as well and I use it to recharge batteries uh, I use it to connect extra devices uh, that are not always plugged in here and usually I have the need to connect an extension to that box and then bring that extension here to the desk to connect any devices now the problem or the biggest problem is that that extension that I need to connect from time to time is more per permanent sorry than temporarily and for the past few months I'm having that problem uh, which is connecting devices once I unplug one I'm gonna connect another one uh, and I'm thinking about Android TV boxes my TV uh, power line adapters and all sorts of devices that I use here uh, on the office that I test and then share them uh, with you on the channel and that is something that is leaving my extension a permanent solution which has two big problems for me one of which is and this is the most important one I've got a two years old uh, kid which is very curious as all of them are and I'm very very cautious about it every time that I leave my office I close the door I unplug that extension and close my case uh, no accidents happen fortunately uh, but it is always a concern to me because that extension as I said is uh, permanently there I do disconnect something but the next day I'm gonna connect or even the, the same day I'm gonna connect uh, something else so that's uh, one of the problems. the other one is a messy thing to have that extension there now I do like to feel comfortable everywhere that I am and at the moment I was not feeling uh, for the past few months as I said I was not feeling comfortable with this solution that I had here and that's why I searched <laughs> this well I searched for a solution and I found these uh, these two and I'm sharing them with you today now moving along uh, these were the biggest problems for me uh, safety uh, especially for my kids uh, especially for the, the younger one because it's very curious the seven-year-old uh, my Daniel doesn't uh, will not touch that but the youngest one it, it's always a risk and if you have any kids you know how it works but this uh, these were my problems now the solution as I said is the power bar and the uh, power cube starting with the power bar very quickly regarding the unboxing is very um, very clean and <laughs> very simple once we open the package we will have the power bar we will have one older we will have the stickers or one sticker in this particular case so that we can uh, connect uh, or, or glue the older to a desk and we can do this vertically or horizontally on the top of a surface on the or underneath a surface as I'm doing here on the office uh, on my desk in, in particular and um, it has also a manual an instructions manual which you will not need it because these are very simple to use the manual has something nice which uh, is some ideas where you can please place these devices and but for that if you go to the website and I will try not to forget to post that as well on the video description you will have a lot of ideas because I'm using in the office but you can use on your bedroom on your living room because these devices are very stylish now um, on my particular case I got with 1.5 meters extension cable and I did assembly as I said under my desk um, and of course we can remove the power uh, bar from the older at any time and just by the way uh, I did all the cable management as you can see there on screen as well I've got everything tight but I'm gonna do a small change over here as I only have 1.5 meters extension uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get a little bit more of an extension about 45 centimeters one meter something like that so that I have some room um, to place uh, or to, to remove the bar and bring it to the top of my desk if I need to in the future that's the only change that I'm going to do by the way the cable management as you could see or as you are seeing on screen uh, was made with some grommets that I bought on a local shop so I've got everything tight you will not see anything hanging right over there everything clean uh, and I'm really happy with this uh, solution after the cable management now I can charge uh, two USB devices if I want to at the same time here and I also can connect two devices with small sockets now the downside on the um, 
power bar is that I can only connect devices with small sockets. If I want to connect the device with a bigger socket, I can't. So that is where the power cube comes in. Now the power cube, let's move on uh, to the unboxing. And the power cube, once we opened uh, the package, we will find, of course, the power cube. One stand, it is a plastic stand, but it's very robust. You can place it anywhere. It's very solid, uh, to use a more accurate word. Uh, it comes with two stickers so that we can glue the stand to any surface and the surface uh, should be uh, clean enough so that it can hold uh, well. It should work on wood as well and all other sorts and you will find instructions on their website so just check out for the surface that uh, you can glue this. And it comes also with a manual which once again you will not be using it. Now this one in particular has two USB, two, uh, two USB ports sorry, uh, to charge devices through USB and also four large sockets that you can um, connect anything that has a big power socket, any power adapter uh, with the large socket you can connect, which happens to me sometimes and I'm, I'm thinking about power line adapters and all that sorts of power um, devices that have a larger socket I can connect and the, the great thing is I can connect up to four uh, and uh, none of them will interfere with each other so that is great. Now um, it has also 1.5 meters and this one is enough for me and just uh, just to show you there, you can see it on the screen right over here, as you can see, and probably you would notice if I didn't say it, but it is very elegant. And right now it's, it's fixed with the stand, but if I remove it like this, uh, just, uh, and I can bring it right over here and I can then connect any device that I need to, my TV for example, my uh, any box that I'm testing on any other device. So this is very elegant. Uh, I can even leave it like this, like this and it doesn't look bad at all. It's very elegant as I said. But let's move on. Um, as I was saying, the assembly can be under a desk or even vertically. On my particular case, I did place it on the top of the desk as you uh, see it right now uh, and the stand is very solid once again we can remove the coupe as as we saw already but once we place it there and just it's not screw but uh, once we turn it it will be very secure so you can uh, move it around and it will not uh, move an inch now this just to say that my cable management box at this moment is always closed I only need to open that box to uh, place my batteries which I will do after I record this video because I'm running out of battery uh, but I will place them there and close the box and that is it so the next day I just remove the uh, batteries and will uh, of course close the box again and I don't need any extension uh, underneath the desk again and I can keep plugging in and plugging out devices right over here on the power cube or also on the power bar so I have these two choices at the moment and I'm even in considering because I did play safe this time I did get a black power bar and a black or gray if you want to call it um, power cube but I'm considering to get another power cube power bar it's enough for me on the office but another power cube to place it underneath the desk here um, and mount it upside down so that I can remove and place it here but I'm thinking about a red one so that they can match with my <laughs> with my chair and well I will see in a few times and if you see it right over here is because I already uh, placed it. Now let's move on to the um, to the conclusion almost. I would like to mention as well that uh, I'm using in the office but you can use this anywhere on your house because it just looks awesome. I can think about a nightstand or on your living room, near your TV, anywhere that, that you find uh, useful. And once again, go to their website, you will, uh, you will see a lot of examples, better than what I can show here. Uh, here is just a office. So now guys, in conclusion, this is the actual conclusion. What I want to mean, uh, or what I want to talk about here is just two points, which is price and quality. Now regarding price, this is not as cheap, and I've got something right over here to show you, is not as cheap as, as cheap. <laughs> not as cheap as cheap as a extension like this this is something like cost one euro or two euros or pounds or dollars or whatever uh, you use in your country but uh, it has nothing to do in terms of quality in terms of design it has nothing to do this works I've used a lot of these in the past but uh, this is something that for example I would not see myself having one of these on my desk and I can see myself using one of these on my desk, on the top of my desk, not beneath my desk, but on the top. So this is something that to consider. Um, once again, the, there's nothing wrong with this. Uh, they're useful, but uh, for the type of usage that I want or for the type of look that I want, 
uh, this is not the, 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 the best, at least on my particular case, and it's not the safest one, at least on my particular case, because I did explain already, uh, especially because of my kids. So price, it is more expensive than any uh, extension like this. There are extensions that are more expensive than this. It's not very expensive, but uh, I have to mention that because the price is, is a major factor. And probably I'm not going to buy this month another power cube, but in a month uh, I will probably get the red one to get right over here on this side of the screen. But in terms of quality, it has nothing to do with what uh, we just seen this is a in terms of quality a great a great um, device in terms of quality and in terms of looks because we can place this anywhere on our house without any problems whatsoever and i feel very comfortable having mine right over here as you can see i'm sorry that i'm not looking at the camera but if i place it right here and then close it and there it is all fixed up over there on the desk and that is it guys i wanted to share this uh, solution for my uh, problem in particular hope that you guys enjoyed the video as always my name is roberto george and i'll see you on the next one